Hi, my name is Sean Ryan here with Novatech. I'm a sales engineer. Uh, here to talk today about the web server SCADA and HMI solution. Uh, essentially behind me is an example of such. Uh, Novatech utilizes Inkscape, which is an open source software package, license free and no other hidden costs associated with it. Uh, what the user is able to do is essentially create an infinitely customizable display option using, again, scale vector graphics. Also with the possibility of overlaying such diagrams over such a thing as a topographic map to show a system one line. On the web server SCADA or the HMI, we're able to display any of the current status, analogs, and also operate different controls. For example, we're able to select a breaker, bring up a dialog box with confirmation of the intended action. For example, with a breaker, it'd be a trip or close action. Select a trip, also given a second confirmation before doing so. For example, we're also able to create dynamically linked pages. For example, for multiple feeders or breakers, we can use essentially one designed page, feed in variables, and then go to that page. For example, as previously alluded to, we're able to show faceplates of field devices, and then with that, show current volts, amps, megawatts, megavars, and then again, all objects on this plate can then be interacted with. Going back to the one line, we're able to go to an annunciator page featured with Novatech. This is an easily configuration grid display showing current alarms within a substation. It can be a grid pattern, anything from as small as three by three up to several different points. Again, anything blinking shows a current unacknowledged alarm. Individual alarms can be selected, then acknowledged, or essentially all alarms can be acknowledged at once just by doing so. Thank you again for your time. Again, my name is Sean Ryan, and for more information, visit our website at novatechweb.com.